Sorry. All right, welcome to another episode of Brad's Kitchen. Brad's Garage. Brad's Garage. So today I'm going to be showing you one of my personal favorites for my collection. This is a 1990, um, 1980? 1999. 1999 BMW that I got off of Craigslist from an old woman named Cho. She let me have this beauty for five... What the f***? Okay, so this is apparently a Toyota Corolla that I got off Craigslist. Uh, I can't help but feel a little bit swindled, but you know, I mean, that's what happens when you're, you know, don't do your research and you purchase a car off some oh old God. woman at Why a chop shop. Why don't you just talk about some of the specifications of the car? Okay, so, 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 as I said, this is a, a 1920... It's 1999. Just talk about the car. It has four doors and four windows, which makes it an eight-cylinder vehicle. I don't suppose you know anything about the history of the car. When the United States invaded Germany, this is this crack right here is where Hitler's head hit. That's also when wrong. they ran him over with this car specifically. So this car is a piece of American history when it really comes down to it because it's responsible for the freedom of all the Jews. Okay, that's A, incredibly offensive, and B, impossible because your car was made in the 90s and World War II happened in the 40s. I'm sorry. So this car has a custom paint job, which uh, we did with uh, an orbital sander, some painter's tape, and some spray paint that we got at uh, Walmart. Uh, the point of this was to make sure that the car depreciated in value by the hey, time we were done. You should go get some Taco Bell. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So these early 90s BMW models. Toyota. Toyota models tend to get a little bit warm when you run the engine. When you first check the box, check the box. You have to make sure that the water temperature is right or else you'll damage it. KFC. And if you damage it, You'll have to take it to a mechanic, and then your dad's going to get mad, and he's going to take your keys away, which is kind of silly because I'm 23. Do you think you can order pizza from one of those call boxes? Hey, dude, my door handle's missing. A lot of parts in the car are missing. It's part of a weight reduction mod. Also, the horn's modified. Is that an Alberto's? We got the horn from an old scrapped Model A. We also have, you know, a number of dents that I have tried multiple times to pull out with a plunger. We've even got, you know, a tape deck there. It's uh, missing the front part because it got stolen. Now I can't even get my Phil Collins tape out. But the real question here is, will it do a burnout? Dude, I don't think it'd do a burnout. Sorry. Hot damn. 